The book of Joshua is a key part of the Hebrew Bible and serves as the sixth book of the Old Testament in the Christian Bible. It follows the events of the book of Deuteronomy and recounts the historical narrative of the Israelites under the leadership of Joshua as they enter and conquer the promised land of Canaan after the death of Moses. The book is filled with military campaigns, conquest, and religious significance providing essential insights into the history, theology, and spirituality of the Israelite people. The narrative begins with the Israelites standing on the east bank of the Jordan River, preparing to cross into the land of Canaan. Joshua, Moses' appointed successor, emerges as the central figure tasked with leading the people and fulfilling God's promise to give them the land of Canaan as their inheritance. Before crossing the Jordan, Joshua sends spies into the city of Jericho, which plays a significant role in the upcoming conquest the Israelites miraculously crossed the Jordan River on dry ground, a symbolic parallel to the crossing of the Red Sea during their escape from Egypt. God instructs Joshua to circumcise the new generation of Israelites, reaffirming their covenant with him. They celebrate the Passover commemorating their deliverance from Egypt and God's providence in the wilderness. At the Battle of Jericho, the Israelites follow God's instructions and march around the city for seven days, culminating in the walls of Jericho miraculously collapsing, allowing the Israelites to conquer the city. However, the victory comes with a warning. The Israelites are commanded not to take any plunder from Jericho, as everything is to be devoted to God. The next major conquest is, but due to a sin within the camp, the Israelites initially face defeat a chance hidden disobedience is revealed. And after dealing with the sin, they successfully conquer. The book goes on to recount the many military campaigns led by Joshua to subdue the various regions of Canaan, often emphasizing the importance of following God's commands and staying faithful to the covenant. In the midst of these accounts of battles and victories, the book of Joshua also includes significant events such as the covenant renewal at Mount Ebal and Mount Gerizim, the deceit of the Jibonites, and the miraculous sun standing still during one of Joshua's battles. As the conquest of Canaan progresses, the land is divided among the 12 tribes of Israel, fulfilling the promise of God to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Joshua delivers a farewell address, exhorting the people to remain obedient to the law of Moses and to serve God alone. The book of Joshua concludes with the deaths of Joshua and Eleazar, the high priest, and a brief account of the burial of Joseph's bones, a reminder of the Israelites' origins and God's faithfulness in leading them to the promised land. 